So what's up YouTube? I'm about to be giving y'all a closet tour of my closet. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I might be showing my shoes and my clothes or just my shoes. I don't really know yet. But yeah, it's gonna be a closet tour. I got some dope stuff. And so yeah, stay tuned. So I just basically put some stuff out from my closet. I really got more than this, but I just pulled out what I'm gonna show in my part one so yeah i pull it down this is my regular shoe side and designer shoe side so yeah that's this that's all right let's get into the video so first we're gonna start with regular shoes to the designer shoes that's how we're gonna do that and so I might get into my clothes. I don't know. I pulled out a little something from my clothes, but yeah. So first, I'm gonna start with these right here. So these are my fours. This is like my second pair of fours. As you can see, they are dirty up, but I was gonna clean them up and sell them on goat. I think I did list them on goat because they got too small for me. Yeah, this is size five. I was size six now, so yeah. So yeah, I got these. These I got these when they actually first first came out, cause I know they recently came out again. But I got these when they first came out, and they all dirty now. So I'ma clean them up some and get my size that I wear now probably. Let's see what this is. I don't even know what this is. Oh, these are my edge on three. These are five and a half, but I can't even fit these. So I think I'm like a six, six and a half because I can't even fit these. Six might be my exact size because I wore these just the other day and these boys hurt my feet well, my toes so bad. But yeah, I caught these when I'm going to say the second time they dropped because they dropped the second time. So yeah. that's when I caught these. I actually got these as a birthday present for my stepdad so thank you to him but i think i put these on goat too for sale because i can't even fit them if i didn't i don't know i'm gonna check today if i didn't and i'm gonna go put them on sale because i can't even fit them and you got these was a size six but they're 11 so they kind of fit small even though they're size six because john 11 they run small so yeah i got these I try not to throw these up as much because these are my first pair of 11s that I ever got because I actually was about to get a low top conference 11s when they came out but they were too small so yeah I actually got these when they dropped in the summertime and I try not to get them dirty because of how much I love them and yeah but I actually think I might go ahead and resell these because they're they're small now because Johnny Levin's run small than them though, so I think I'm going to go resell these. A lot of my shoes got to be resold because my feet just grew. So, yeah. What's next? And I got the Air Jordan 10s. They run small too because these are five and a half. So, these, I actually don't like these, but... I'm not a fan of 10s, but I think I just got them when I was younger. I probably was like in 7th grade, and I just got them when they came out just because of the side, the number on the side. So, yeah, one time before these, they actually did drop like these, but they didn't have the number on the side. And I thought it was cool that they had a number on the side, so that's honestly probably why I got them. I don't even know because these dropped a long, 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 long time ago, so... Yeah, I actually put these on go for resale too. So yeah, these are five and a half. They are on gold. Pretty much all my basic shoes are uh, on go need to be sell except for my G Nikes because I recently just started copying G Nikes. So these are the um Air Force One Utility size six. These are the lime green ones. Yeah. I dirty these up. I dirty these up at a class at a uh, senior picnic recently. This is my first. It was my first time really, really wearing them out, and I stood out. But like, I really dirty them up, so I really gotta clean them out. Clean them up. Um, yeah. So, 
see the thing that got me with these is when I saw the strap part. That really got me with these, so that really sold me. And I, I just think these are so fire, but I'm about to stop wearing them because a lot of people are starting to buy them. Because these wasn't even in the store yet when I got them. So, yeah. So, these are actually one of my shoes that fit, so I'm going to put them over there. Everything else is getting sold, going over there. Then I got some Air Force that I just brought to. And I brought a five and a half in these Air Force. And this was like late October. I bought a five and a half in these Air Force. These are my first pair of Air Force, by the way. Except for the black Air Forces, but I had those when I was younger for school. So, I brought these in five and a half, even though I wear a six, because five and a half was my exact size at the time. I thought, if you get your exact size, that they won't crease. So, that's why I brought them in five and a half. But, as you can see, they kind of creased. I don't know if you can see it or not, but they kind of creased. But, they ain't creased as bad. Yeah, so that's these. And I try not to wear these as much because I really like them. I really like them to stay white. And I really loved the these when I brought them. And I would junior class color. I wouldn't feel like a uh, junior color day. Our junior class color was red. So if you're from New Orleans, you know you wear the G Nikes with the Dicky suit. So that's what I wore with these. So yeah, shout out to the Dicky suit and these. But yeah so I still wear these I can fit them they just exact and then so my last time I got these I brought these early December they came in the middle of December I ordered them from GOAT as you can see there's some Yeezys so yeah it's not none of the exotic ones which I think I should have ordered because it was actually a birthday gift I think I should have ordered some exotic ones. But I actually got these for lower than the re the retail price. So that's actually why I got them. They were lower than the retail price. I can't even remember how much they were, but they were lower than the retail price. And I actually wore them on Christmas. So, yeah. Ain't that dirty. I think I got something on them for Christmas, but they came out with some water and a towel. But yeah, so that's that's my basic shoe collection with the Johns, the Yeezys, the J-Nikes. I got more shoes, but they up and down, and I didn't feel like pulling all of it out and keep going back and forth in the closet. So yeah, that's my basic shoe collection. Now I'm about to get into my designer. Starting off with these. These are not even shoes, I don't think. But it was a Christmas present, yeah. It was a Christmas present. They're not even shoes. But these slippers, they too big for me, so they're too big for me, so like I didn't even wear them yet. Cause right now I'm just stealing my Gucci slides that I have Cause they fit me exact But these don't This is a present for my dad So yeah I probably want to use a break in I don't know when cause I think it's too late To go exchange my size and sex I don't know But yeah that was way in December And now it's like a new year And yeah This was a Mardi Gras cop When I was in the ninth grade I got the well, I got them for Christmas, but they were from Mardi Gras. Like I said, if you're from New Orleans, you know you gotta wear your best gear at Mardi Gras. If you don't wear your best gear at Mardi Gras, then you just. But yeah, so I got these. I wore these. These. I actually got some Balenciaga runners. Like, I'm gonna go put those out because they're not even in my closet. I got some Balenciaga runners too. So I got these in Balenciaga's and the runners in Balenciaga's. So I got these Javinci shoes. These are more Javinci's. But these are actually shoes and they wasn't in the box. But yeah. So, what's all I got these in? I got these in the 37 and a half. Some designer shoes, they don't really run in halves. 
most of them. I don't know. Well, the ones that I want, that I always seem to want, they don't really have sizes. So I will have to get a whole size that's probably too big or too small for me. But these actually ran in half sizes. So I got 37 and a half. 38 would be so, so small. And I got these Gucci shoes. The y'all ain't know Gucci used to be my favorite. Like, I had Gucci every day. That just was my favorite. Like, when I copped these, they was my favorite. I thought these was hard. I thought these was harder than anything, dog. Because they had the red at the back of this shoe, right? Then when you come out with this shoe, right here, they had the green. I thought these were hard as I don't know what. I still do think they're hard. I love these shoes. I actually did a review on these shoes when I first got them. That was last year. So I did a review on these shoes. You could go check that video out. That's like the video before the last video that I dropped. So yeah. Last video that I dropped was a prank on my mom. Make sure y'all go get that. What size I got these? I don't even know the size that I got. Probably like a 37 though. Most likely. Yep, 37. So. I didn't even think these was in my closet. Alright. I haven't worn these in so long. I got them as a gift in A grade for my birthday. I got my first pair of red bottoms in A grade for my birthday. And I didn't rest all over these. But mind you, I was in the A grade. So yeah, I messed all over these. This 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 was white. This kind of yellow. I don't know if you can really see it, but it's kind of like a oldish white creamish yellowish and it's like all scuffed up but like it's it's cleanable but it's not because the scuffs gonna still stay on there because like it's a different type of texture but yeah so i got these an a grade as a present for my birthday so i thought these was hard just i don't know what like i feel as if all the other red bottoms they make your feet hurt but with these i wore these for mardi gras in Mardi Gras again. I wore these for Mardi Gras and they did not make my feet hurt at all. So yeah. Alright y'all, so these are the other Balenciaga runners. No, I had the other Balenciaga. These are the runners that I had got. I don't even wear these though because I don't like the way they look on my feet. So, give them to them. Cause they was, this was a birthday gift this year too for my birthday but i didn't like the way it fit on my feet like my feet is too skinny for the shoes so yeah, that, didn't, that didn't work out well so yeah that's the end of the shoes right y'all so i don't really feel like showing my clothes and my belts but i probably do it next video because i still didn't show all the rest of my shoes i think i showed all the designer shoes but i didn't show all my like basic shoes like jaw ends and nagging and stuff like that. I didn't show all of it because most of it is old and I can't fit it, so I didn't show that. But yeah, my next video, I probably show that and I probably show my shirts and my belts and my jeans and things like that. So make sure you get this video a thumbs up. Make sure you comment and make sure you subscribe and get my subscribers up because my subscribers are. But yeah, stay tuned for the next video and thanks for tuning in. I was just six playing with Steve.